Okay, we have Tori Kane. Invocation Treacherous Crows. When in the basement near the circle, press the ability button 2 to begin the invocation. Invocations take 60 seconds. Other survivors will see your aura during this and can join on in ongoing interaction. Once the invocation is completed, you become injured and gain the broken status effect for the rest of the trial. When a survivor is in the terror radius and the killer scares a crow, their aura is revealed to all survivors for 2 seconds. Completing the invocation disables that perk for all survivors. So it's get a hook state for snitch and ass crows to be on your side. Okay. Clean break. After you finish healing another survivor while being healed by another survivor, press the ability button 1 to gain the broken status effect. After 60 seconds, you become healthy. This perk does not activate if you're already broken. The effect is cancelled if you go into the dying state. So you can passively heal over 60 seconds like a syringe but longer. Once per uh, shoulder the burden. Once per trial, as long as you are not on death hook, press the ability button 2 in front of a hook survivor to unhook them. When there, oh wait, hold on. I thought this one gave you a hook state. Let me reread this then. So when they are unhooked, they lose one hook state and you gain one hook state. You also scream and gain the exposed status effect for 20 seconds. Okay, so this would be a good perk for Ren to run because he almost never gets hooked until like end game if anything so he could use this to save somebody who is on second stage bring them back to first stage and then he would take a hook state and then would need to pair that with something for extra endurance because then you could just both get fucked by it but there's some wiggle room with that one I guess they need survivors so we will, oh, I guess I didn't need to do for it, but if we want to pair it with something, then we have it, uh, search. All right. All right, all right, all right. Um, okay, that was weird. Whoa! I feel like I'm still being followed by the damn dog. Now it shows the progress of you healing somebody. Oh, that was a cool animation in the U uh, UI, in the hood.
That just scared me. Her weapon is very small. What what am I looking at? The dog? What the dog doing? Oh. I wonder what happens if you combine the two weaving spells. I don't know how I medium bolted that. I was trying to fire bolt it. How do we feel about the gauge telling um another survivor how long till they finish another objective? Dang it! Did she bring a Mori? She didn't bring a Mori, sis. I was so confused. I thought that was happening in game and I was like, what just got blown up? Steve just put a spotlight on me. My house. I'm interested to see about the invocation for both of them. See if you can do both against the Howlmaster. Who would have thought? Is there a new map? Yes. There is a new map. I don't... I don't know the map. I haven't... I've only seen... I saw Ott's a little bit when he was testing out some perks together as killer, but I didn't see the entirety of it. So you can only do one, it looks like. You have to do them separately and it changes. So Treacherous Crows took precedent over weeding, Weaving Spiders. So you have to waste 120 seconds in order to do both. So it's not, it doesn't stack like a boon perk does. Oh, the hook state changes a different color. If you notice in the bottom, the bottom Tori, her hook is yellow and it's usually white. So she took a hook state. Kind of feel like the dog gets in the way a little bit. We're both broken. I don't know why you're staring at me like I could do something. I don't know where the other freaking thing was. 
I'll third us. Wow, they left me so she can get a Mori. That was kind of spooky with the glowing eyes. Like, I'm just, I'm, these Moris are so boring lately. Like, it just bores me. Floods of Rage, All Shaking Thunder, Jagged Compass, Pain Res, Jesus Christ. Just... Shiro thinks this chick is a monk. It's giving monk. Who cares? She's from Scotland. That's all that matters. That is a conversation that just happened. These... May survivors be thirsty, man. Alright, so this is all about saving people, hunting things, the family business, you know? Ideally, we don't want to be caught first. Okay, they did uh, weaving spiders. So they're learning the hard way that th it looks like they ha they're no mither too. So they're running no mither with both invocation spells. Looks like we have an AFK killer so I can't even attempt my build. Uh, blast mine. I'll blast mine. Uh, chemical trap. And just like this, the game is over. The survivor is dicking her around on a chemical trapped um, pallet. And boom. Game over. That's game. That was a really fast match, wasn't it, chat? I guess we GG next with the build. Again, not the new map. Gang gang. Gang gang. Gang gang gang. Gang 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 gang. Alright, let's go. What the dog doing? The, I don't think the peace signs showed up in the lobby or in chat, but they show up on screen here. Kind of. <laughs> oh, I should try to get a Boland and Muppy Bark. Did I say Boland and Muppy Bark? I meant Knox. Oh, Jesus Christ. I think I'm getting sick. My brain just ain't raining. <laughs> Somebody clip that and send that to Poland. <laughs> uh. 
<laughs> Dang, he's really strong. Basically hold you in place. Not gonna make it. Ah. Oh. <sighs> that was actually that sounded like it was an in-game alert, not a blurp alert. That was a good one. I was just so focused on trying to make it to the pallet. That didn't really get me. Bitch, get off my dick, Jesus Christ. Why am I endured? It, yep, it really is just Merciless Storm for healing. Is that when you're playing with us? Because I wasn't paying attention to them. <laughs> Literally wasn't. I zoned out. Shit, she saw me. <laughs> nope, no doggy gonna bite my butt. She gave up on me. What in the fuck is happening? <laughs> ah, you the, they played together. <laughs> That's what happened there. Oh, merciless storm. Fuck! <laughs> Oh. 